small kitchen where everything is easy to make and delicious to eat. Today I have a treat for you, a quick and easy appetizer. We're gonna be making potato croquettes. That in Spanish is croquetas de papa. Delicious, we're adding cheese and bacon. You know, everything with bacon always tastes good. This is so easy because I am using leftover mashed potatoes. So if you have leftover mashed potatoes, you can definitely make this. But if you don't, you can make your mashed potatoes. You have to let it cool a bit because we're gonna be making the croquettes and the croquettes you need your hands. And you also need to, we don't want to do scrambled eggs. We're gonna be using eggs as well. So just make your mashed potatoes, let it cool for a bit. You can even put it in the refrigerator for an hour or two, and then you can make the croquettes if you don't have leftover mashed potatoes. So the ingredients to make this potato croquettes are mashed potatoes. I have here about two cups of mashed potatoes, leftover mashed potatoes. But like I said, if you don't have leftover, you can just make your mashed potatoes and let it cool a bit. We're gonna be needing one egg, breadcrumbs as well. I do not have breadcrumbs. <laughs> so by then, just mashed um, salted crackers. So this is what I have. And we're gonna be needing bacon as well. It's cooking right there in my stove top. And cheese. I have four cheese here, Mexican four cheese, and I have mozzarella. And the Mexican four cheese, it has, it has mozzarella, it has Monterey Jack cheese, it has Colby cheeses, and skin mozzarella as well. Okay guys, so, this is my bacon start. already cooked and crunchy. What I'm gonna do is just gonna cut into little pieces so I can add it to a mixture. everything together, all the ingredients, I'm a Place it in your hands, make sure your hands are washed, and then just make the shape of little croquettes, like an oval shape, just like that. This is what we're going to be doing to all of them, and then we're going to fry them. Guys, so as you can see, it has like little bacon bits because that's, this is the same pan I cooked the bacon in, and I also added like half to a cup of um, oil, cooking oil. ready to turn them over I'm gonna let them fry okay guys in the meantime you want to put a plate and put some napkins on top that way we can put the potato croquettes on top and it could absorb some of the oil Okay guys, so here in this bed I have um, lettuce, some lettuce leaves, just for the presentation. You know what I'm saying, saying. Delicious. It already 
looks crunchy from the outside, delicious and moist and smooth in the inside. Well, you guys saw how easy it was and I think I'm gonna give it a taste. Let's see. Mm. How delicious it was and cheesy ah, so easy bacon leftover mashed potatoes some eggs some delicious cheese delicious cheese I can't even talk what's going on here I hope you guys like this recipe if you liked it please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more recipes like this one I'm with Emily and remember that the whole ingredients is gonna be in the description box down below so you guys can check it you guys can make it and let me know how you like it so I'll see you next time. Bye.